Hello from SheNature.com, this is Mark Josie. Today you see we got a WE Tech uh, gas blowback rifle, the M4 uh, open bolt version. So it's actually a green gas uh, powered rifle. You can use CO2 magazine with the 12 grams, but it's not stock. Okay, doesn't come with it. So let us fire some shots. Maybe you can see the recoil too. Very amazing. Okay. Very amazing recoil, but green gas is fucking expensive. So everyone knows if you if you play green gas with airsoft, you want to have propane or you want to have green gas, whatever, or switch to CO2. Okay. The thing is green gas they cools down or freeze up very quickly and so your mag is very cold if you fire like that fast okay so and also one bottle of green gas is about 14 bucks so that is a lot of money if you shoot a lot so if you use propane it's very stinky and you don't like that rotten smell so what can you do today i found one solution but still it's not complete okay just mind you that it's not complete yet what you will need is this is the Mad Bull Grenade Charger and yes someone online already did it um, it's not the first guy doing it but I'm doing it the right way so that you can learn something okay so the problem is this grenade charger is like that okay it allows you to push CO2 through this regulator and then inject into whatever you like okay this injection injecting uh, adapter will fit your grenade launcher or the green gas shell okay so you want this on but you don't need the 12 grams so take this part off there's uh two screws here take the lower one out with an allen key and then you can unscrew this okay so basically you have your charger and the head right now i'm going to charge up the shell with hpa Okay, so to inject with HPA, the best way out is not just to screw that on your tank, of course. Screw that, um, screw a on-off ASA on your tank with a quick disconnect fitting. You see, quick disconnect right here, okay. You can buy these fitting at paintball store. And then now you have your ASA to uh, quick disconnect right here that goes here. Okay, so your Mad Bull charger. I'm going to screw this ASA right on where the CO2 goes, okay? Just like that. You see how easy that is? No tools required. And then now you can charge up the shells by using this tank, little HPA tank. Let me push these things aside first. I have some space to work with. Okay. So, we want to charge it up with air. And these air, you can pump it back up with a, with a hand pump. And uh, it's really affordable. Okay, so with um green gas it's about 110 or 160 psi so we're not going to get that with this charger anyway we're going to screw that charger on and then now we're going to gas up the whole unit okay as you see right now it's about 300 psi already so what we're going to do is we have to gas out the these uh, air and let the air goes so push it on the ground Okay, right now you can see it's at the 2 mark, okay, 200 PSI and it's staying around there, okay. So 200 PSI is pretty low and close to that kind of pressure. Make sure your uh, mag is empty and have no oil in there. Do not put HPA and oil together. Okay, right now as you can see it's at the 2 mark, so 200, 200 PSI. It's not going to work but it's going to work for a little bit. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. It's not going to work, uh, but we'll try. So 200 PSI. Nothing explodes. Very nice. Okay. Coffee gun. So we get about five shots or six shots. Let's try that again. The key is lower the pressure. So lower the pressure a little bit more. 
Let's try again, okay? We'll try to get seven or eight shots. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Let's try again. Push more air. Okay, I think that's it. So I pushed quite a lot of air in there. Let's see how many shots we can get. Pretty impressive, eh? It still worked. Okay. So about five shots, that's it. Max. And it works, right? It works. <laughs> so it works, but the problem is the PSI level is too high. And this regulator cannot give you the pressure we need. So right now we can vent this. Okay. And now it's the gas zero pressure. See? So what we need right now, which we have to get soon, is the Ninja low power regulator. That unit will allow you to plug instead of this in the middle, we will have um, that regulator in the middle and then still have this over here. And then we can inject the air from a tank like this to the low power regulator and then set the pressure to 110 to 160 psi fill this thing up and then it will give you one meg of shot just like green gas we just need to imitate the pressure level that's all and so basically it means that if you can regulate the air like this into this uh, using the 160, 110 PSI, you can also regulate CO2 to that kind of pressure, maybe, and use it in the uh, green gas mag as well. So I'm not sure about the CO2 part, but I'm so sure about the, the HPA part. It should work, and I'm going to try that later on in the future when I get that thing. And then, if we can do so, then you don't need to tap your magazine anymore. You can just inject HPA right into the mag, and then shove it in, you still have all that realism and you can have your uh, gun working 100% just like with green gas and you don't need that little uh, quick disconnect here with a hose and all that crap. So you still have realism but instead of paying for the green gas, now you can have air. Very fun. Okay, so hope that thing will uh, be successful and we'll try that out later on. Thank you for watching. Remember to subscribe and like. Bye-bye.